What's up guys, Rick here from Shop Productions, and today we're going to be going over a very simple redstone design uh, for a minecart sorter. This is going to sort regular minecarts from minecarts with chests, and essentially what this is, I developed the sorter in a way of making your mine shafts more simpler, so if you do actually use minecarts for um, your mine shafts and you use the minecart with chests uh, for your mine shafts, this is a very simple way to separate your minecart with chests from your normal minecart that you use to go down the line, assuming you only have one line, and you like, let's say, you want to make this minecart chest go into a sorting system and unload, this is a very simple way to determine which minecart goes where. So the way this basically works is it uses a detector rail to and a comparator to detect if there are any items present in the minecart with chests. So regular minecarts, whether there's a player in them or not, will pass on through and so will empty minecart chest and these will all get destroyed by the cactus and fed into this chest here so you can see that's where these all end up however if there is even one item let's put in this chest for example in this minecart with the chest that will detect it it will switch the rail and it will get sent off into wherever you want that to go so we're going to go ahead and start the tutorial by looking at something like this and this is kind of what you want your setup to look like uh, with the rails and what we're going to have here is the inbound rail this is where your minecarts are going to come in and this is where you're going to want to place your detector rail you're going to have your unloading and sorting system off to the side uh, and this is where you want the full minecart with chests to go ahead and automatically unload and sort all the items that you collected while mining and this is where your players and your empty minecarts will uh, end up crashing into this cactus and just disappearing into whatever storage system you want here so in order to get started with this, we're going to go ahead and start by placing a comparator right next to the detector rail. If it's one block lower, it won't work, so you have to make sure it is on the same level. We're going to go ahead and make the comparator go into a block with a piece of redstone dust directly under it. And this next part is situational. It completely depends on which way the rail is connecting. So if it looks something like this, where it's connecting the inbound and the unloading and sorting system rails, you're going to want to put a block here with the redstone torch there and a piece of redstone dust to invert this rail here um, to make, because by default, you want the unloading and the player and empty minecarts rail to be connected like this by default. And if they already are connected by default, then all you're going to do is put a repeater here and a piece of redstone dust um, but that is completely situational if these are already connected but I'm gonna leave it like this for now because this is the situation we're dealing with and pretty much that's it that's the end of the build it's a very simple concept if you guys did like this video and you want to see more things like this make sure you like comment and subscribe and um, with that being said I will see you guys next time thank you for watching bye bye